Hi and welcome to part two of my video um, which involves me creating a X slide uh, power slide for my um, milling machine. If you remember if you've watched part one I've got a nine co copy made by Axminster uh, which has done me well. Um, in part one we covered the uh, setup of the more mechanical side of the power slide and actually showed you working. In part two, um, not really a lot to show, but what I've done now is I've done the electronics um, or the electrical side of it. Um, so without further ado, um, here we go. Here is the finished product. Um, I've made uh, a rather nifty little aluminium cover to cover the white motor. And then on top here, is my control box um, that is for the um, speed and that is for direction uh, so you go off one way reverse and then forward and down here is the power supply that I bought um, hopefully if I remember there will be links either at the end of the video um, or on the actual description of uh, this YouTube video uh, detailing where I got the individual parts from. Um, but without further ado, let me show you it working. Um, so it's a case of switching the power on. Just need to engage. Okay, let me just show you the um, how it works. Uh, we'll switch the power on. That switches it on and you can see and <clears throat> I can increase the speed and then I can reverse the direction and again and you can have it running pretty slow. Um, the <clears throat> The on off on switch um, is not the one supplied with the PWM and uh, that was just a rocket switch and I didn't particularly like it. So I've actually used um, an indicator switch um, that I had lying around um, from my catering days. So there you have it. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video and um, thanks again for all the views and for watching my part one and I hope you enjoyed part two as much as you enjoyed part one. Thank you.